So I'm here at Walmart on State Line and I'm gonna try and do a walkthrough to kind of show you around the place. I usually park over here by Lawn and Garden, so uh, I may walk up so you can see the size of the building. But back here is uh, the automotive part. You pull around back like this and they have a tire center they change your oil. You can access this through the. Um, you can access this through Walmart on the interior, but you pull up back here if your car needs serviced, and then you go in and do your shopping, and come and pick it up later. So this is around back, and so uh, you can see I'm parked over there, and then this is the garden center. This is where I usually come in because. Uh, it's better parking. It's not usually as full. You can hear all the birds in the lawn and garden part. And being as this is the big Walmart on State Line, they have much bigger variety than the other Walmarts I go to. So, out back was the Okay, you can see the entrance is way down there. The building itself is huge. Parking lot's huge. But this is uh, the lawn and garden. They got new stuff out. Ooh, I like that. So this is a really big lawn and garden department. It just goes and goes and goes. And like I said, I won't be able to show you everything. Um, but I want to kind of give you an idea of the size of the place. This is, it just goes, I don't know if you can see, it goes all the way up to that wall. And it's all outdoor stuff. And there's, they got some Christmas trees up there. But it's mostly plants, barbecue stuff, outdoor stuff, and, uh, excuse me, ma'am. And... During Christmas, they have a bunch of like bicycles and stuff out here. So this is the lawn and garden entrance. And of course, it's like uh, Christmas right now. I'm going to try and not get any people. They got all the trees up, but they're not quite decorated yet. And when it's not Christmas or seasonal, this is all like lawn care stuff. But right now it's Christmas time, so it's all Christmas stuff. You can see it's a large Christmas department. And then over here, this is pets, and then it changes into health and beauty. So we got pet care, several aisles. They even have refrigerators in pet care now for the refrigerated and frozen pet foods. And there is lots more Christmas over there. That just continues on down into automotive. You can see the Christmas just goes and goes and goes and then way back at the back of the store, that's automotive. We'll get there in a minute. But yeah, so from Christmas to pets, I'm going to try my best to not get people. Still pets. Okay, now we're getting into um, health and beauty. So this is all the makeup. Of course, there's a recording in progress. When you're in some of these aisles, you're being recorded to make sure that you don't steal anything. So health and beauty, hair care. This is the cologne makeup. And brushes. This is all health and beauty. Big section. And then after health and beauty, we slowly are going to merge on over here into the pharmacy. Okay, so after that section of health and beauty, we're now in the pharmacy. You can see. 
it's a full pharmacy. They have everything a regular, regular one would have. Okay, now across from the pharmacy is the homewares. So we've got everything from candles and appliances to towels and sheets and everything you can possibly imagine for your home. This is shower, bathroom. Um, all of this is bedding, kitchen, dishes, more bedding. Okay, so this just goes on forever with the cookware and everything and bedding going on forever and ever. Microwaves. I need one of those. Containers. Appliances. Oh, look at that. What a beauty. Mm. Okay, so after housewares... Um, we're into hardware. Okay, so Christmas was over there, and it turned into hardware, which is here. And so we also have a large hardware department, which includes paint. So you can come here and buy paint and have it mixed here at the paint place. There's a whole big section for paint. It's basically like a hardware store and a paint store all mixed together. Then across the way, we've got um, more housewares, containers, vacuum cleaners, steam cleaners, just any kind of like carpeting or rug cleaning system. It's here. Here's some rugs more housewares and now we're in furniture there's some luggage I got my futon from here it's not great I would have rather had one like this so yes yeah, pretty pretty decent furniture department some dressers and stuff entertainment center they've got some beds and things over here So yeah, that's all the furniture. And then we're getting into uh, more of the hunting. This is the hunting stuff. So I think hardware is going to turn into game and fish. We got plenty of deer corn. And some fishing poles. Let's see here. Lots of fishing poles. So we're in game and fish now. This is the fishy part. Lots of fishy lures. And fishing poles and nets. Here we go with the camping. Some camping gear. And then this is automotive. All the stuff you might need for your car or vehicle. And when I came up and parked out by Lawn and Garden, I was kind of over by the automotive center on the outside. And this is the automotive care center on the inside. This is where you come in at. And let's see. Okay, so automotive and then there's tires and okay so more hunting stuff more sports stuff this is all the sporty stuff it's right next to the hunting area 
and there are coolers here's some weight training equipment treadmill lunch boxes and more coolers okay so i think that's about it on on hunting this is where you can buy your firearms and the ammunition right there more camo all right let's see so we've done like a corner that that's like one corner of walmart so we've got bikes and during the christmas rush they'll have a lot more outside as well besides all of these so that means we're in the toy section tons of toys babies cars just everything so many toys they usually have a lot of toys but it is getting close to Christmas so okay so this is more housewares more candles more decorative stuff there's books this whole aisle is books and this is all housewares just everything for your house lots of mirrors picture frames just random stuff for your house and then now school supplies I love these colors it's always hard when you're coloring to find a good flesh color and this one has got every flesh color it's wonderful love those I wish they'd had them when my kids were little so okay this is all school supplies and stationery, business, just poster boards and office supplies. Yeah, that's mostly, these are notebooks, office supplies, packing materials. And across the way is the entertainment division. This is where you're gonna buy your TVs, movies, games, and just everything for entertainment so we'll take a quick take a quick loop through here so I got all the different equipment you might need for any reason I am not impressed with this name brand this is the one I bought the ONN name brand is the one I bought for my mount in my Jeep and it keeps breaking and falling apart so that's not cool and lots of TVs. You can see there's a whole wall. Movies. Let's see, there's people over there. So anyway, you get the idea. Phones, computers, TVs, game systems, that sort of thing. In the entertainment. Now let's go across the way to clothing. Okay, so here's boys wear. Lots of boys wear. Lots of shoes on the other side. Here's the shoe department. More shoes than you can imagine. And more clothes. So here's um, boys. And here's girls. Ladies lingerie. And we got some men's coats over here. more menswear and they have the socks and pants and shirts and vests and work clothes so they've got a large menswear department as you can see I'm trying to give you an overall view of how big this store is we got hats, we got shorts, 
We got socks. Okay, now easing on out of the menswear into the jewelry department. They do have some nice stuff here. Beautiful watches. Sunglasses. Lots of earrings. Beautiful necklaces. Lots of jewelry. The stuff in the cases is nice too. So you see there's lots of nice little jewelry around. Okay. I'm sorry I keep putting you towards the floor like that, but I'm trying not to get like other people who don't want to be recorded or haven't agreed to this. <laughs> I'm trying to keep them from being in it. So yeah, that's the jewelry department. And we will ease on out of the jewelry top department into women's wear. Here we go. Ladies clothing. And it is a very large, very large department of ladies clothing. tons of ladies clothing after you get through ladies clothing it just switches right to girls you go from ladies to girls they have lots of cute things for little girls this season much of it looks like stuff I wore when I was a teenager Okay, so that's going to be the end of ladies wear, and we're going to go on over into the baby section. So they have everything you need for your baby, and then they also have a section of infant wear. So this is all the different stuff you need for baby, diapers, wipes, all those things. And then this section is the clothes and the shoes and stuff some really adorable fall wear for baby I love this brown Mickey that's so cute and let's see over there more stuff for baby there's strollers I had a three-wheeled stroller when Forrest was little I loved it car seats cribs Play pins, umbrella strollers, beds, and past that, past all of this is we're back into shoes. So I think that's the majority of the store that is not food. Um, now we'll take a quick look around the food department and then I'll show you the front of the store. Okay, so this is going to be drinks, um, alcoholic and non-alcoholic drinks in this area. We have cold beer. Let's see. Juice and mixers and wine. Here we go. This is what I get is wine. And so that's all of there's some water, sparkling water and juice. We're into the refrigerated section now with the butter and the canned rolls, cinnamon rolls, biscuits and bread. Over there is all of the dairy. And then the next one is all of the yogurts. And this is our eggs. American keeps their eggs refrigerated because we wash them. And that removes the natural cuticle. And so they have to be refrigerated after that. Whereas people in Europe 
uh, don't refrigerate their eggs because they haven't been power washed and they still retain their natural cuticle and can stay good on the shelf much, much longer than if they've been cleaned. Okay, so here is a bunch of sweet tea. And it just shows you the kind of like, this is lunch meat. I mean, that, that's just lunch meat and hot dogs, all of that. And you can see how there's just like a, an extreme amount of choice on everything. There's also a lot of people in here right now, so I'm trying not to get people. Um, your cleaning products are also over here with the groceries. Um, all your laundry and your dish, dishwashing liquid. I think, I think you call them fairy suds, fairy bubbles, fairy suds <laughs> in the UK. And laundry soap. As you can see there, this is fabric conditioner or fabric softener. I think y'all call it fabric conditioner. But uh, as you can see, we have, uh, we're spoiled for choice here. We have too much. This, this row is all potato chips. And this one is all cereal. And this one is all baking goods. And this one is all candy and sodas. An entire row of just candy and sodas. So here we have some dry goods like beans and rice. Here we have some sauces like barbecue sauce, tomato sauce, that kind of stuff. This is bread and coffee. We'll take a quick run down the coffee so you can just see how many kinds of coffee are available. Okay, now it's tea. And now it's peanut butter. And jelly. And honey. But you can see there was so much coffee. So these central coolers are all filled with meat. All of them all the way up and down. And so, are, so is that one. And this one, and let's see here, we have bread, seafood, flowers, there's the bakery over there where you can order cakes, have all kinds of wonderful stuff made. <coughs> All these lovelies, and it's a fresh daily bakery. They make all this stuff every day. And there's also a deli where you can get deli meat and cheese, but it's also a hot deli where you can get like fried chicken, potato salad, you know, this kind of stuff. And then we ease on into produce where we get all our fresh fruit and veg. There are probably three rows of canned fruit and veg in the other part of the store. But there's so many people right now that I'm trying not to get any persons on there because they don't want to be on there. But as you can see, fresh fruit and veg, Walmart has a pretty good produce department. They get a hard time about it, but I, I'm not disappointed in their produce. I think that it's just fine. I've not ever had a real issue with that. This is nice, all the stuff to make guacamole. And then they have this little part over here where you can pick up, oh, you know, hummus, dip, or pre-made pizzas like that, stuff like that. Okay, and so 
this Walmart's restaurant is a Subway. So they have a Subway restaurant right there. And then there's customer service. Um, this is where you get your lotto tickets. And this is all the checkouts. <clears throat> a whole lot of them are self-checkout now. This is where you pick up your online orders. And this is a bank. Um, they also sell cigarettes here, so it's the tobacconist as well. There's the front store restrooms. Usually this is made into like kind of a media area where you find magazines and newspapers and stuff. But then around Christmas, they change it to stocking stuffers. And I think the last thing that was in this area was a place to get your taxes done. It probably pop back up closer to Christmas. And then, of course, they have your ice and a hair styling place, beauty salon. And then, of course, right in the front door, we've got the seasonal stuff. So, and I think that's about it. Just right now, it's Halloween. You know, they got uh, Christmas down in Lawn and Garden, but they've got all the Halloween stuff out up here at the front. And you can see they have other costumes and stuff all. Lots of costumes and candy buckets. Yeah. Okay, so I think that's about it. Um, I think I kind of showed you what I was going to show you and uh, gave you a good overview of Walmart. If you've not been to a super Walmart, well, then this was it. Um, here's the birthday cards and wrapping paper. And, of course, I didn't show it all to you. But um, it's enough to let you know that making a choice in Walmart can sometimes be difficult because there is so much going on. Oh, but that being said, I've got to get to shopping. I hope y'all enjoyed this walk around. I'm talking to you, Sabina. <laughs> y'all have a good day and be sweet.